Welcome back to Sunday morning. We're at half past the hour. New information from NASA on why Boeing's first attempt to launch astronauts into space was scrubbed moments before liftoff. News Nation's Alicia Nieves joining us now. Alicia, you're following this yesterday. You're in the newsroom. You're waiting for the launch. It doesn't happen. What do we know this morning? Yeah, I mean, this was a long-awaited launch, right? And I just want to point out how long-awaited we're talking about here. NASA's crew kind of program here with Boeing and others began back in 2017, excuse me, 2010. The first crewed launch was initially planned for 2017. That is seven years ago. But okay, we dealt with that delay. Then yesterday, finally, Boeing was going to launch the Starliner, make good on this multi-billion dollar deal with NASA to be this ferry or taxi, if you would, transporting NASA astronauts to and from the International Space Station. Astronauts Barry Butch Wilmore, Sunita Suni Williams were strapped in shortly before takeoff. And then three minutes, 50 seconds before launch, a flight controller declared, hold, hold, hold. NASA saying a computer ground launch sequencer was not loading into the correct operational configuration. According to experts that we have spoken to, this is not an issue with Boeing's actual Starliner capsule, but a communication issue on the ground with ground control. We're told, though, this is typically a minor issue that was expected to be resolved pretty quickly, by today at least. So it's a bit puzzling why NASA and Boeing have postponed the launch today. We know there have been other issues, right, with the Starliner. This is actually the third delay. May 6th was the initial launch date. They heard a rattling noise with a valve on the Starliner. That led to that delay. Then the issue was not addressed by the next launch date, May 17th. So yet another delay. Then as recent as an hour and a half before launch on Saturday, we got reports of a valve issue on the Starliner, but that was also then told it was quickly resolved. So unclear this morning all the reasons why the launch was delayed, and it's hard to believe that it's simply just the ground control issue, but that's what we're getting told officially. Thanks for watching. Go to joinnn.com to find News Nation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of News Nation's fact driven, unbiased coverage.